Hello everyone, and thank you for joining me here. My name, of course, is not Philip Piton, but it is Mr. Mocha Lover. And let us continue beating up a couple Axis members like Nazis, brown shirts or black shirts from Italy, and a tank division randomly in the Midwest of the United States. So, oh wow. But let's keep going. Oh, look, an indie bundle tracker at the bottom left. All right, then. Let's see. Ooh, the Japanese really need to guard their convoys a little bit better. But, ooh. Sunk a German sub. What are you guys doing? Moving to a sign fleet area. Uh, okay. These guys are locating a task force in the Eastern Caribbean. Ooh. Light cruiser. Heavy cruiser. Two carriers, so... In terms of naval combat, these guys should probably do okay against a single, very injured light cruiser. And let's see. It's really cool. We can monitor the strength of it, total damage received, and by who did the damage to the injured ship. A better positioning is not as good. You want the best positioning as humanly possible. So the view that's why the fewer ships you have in each fleet, it's technically better. Oh, but we sunk it anyways because our firepower is just so incredibly good compared to the Germans. Oh, and Japanese people lost a couple. Convoys. Sunk a destroyer. Sunk a destroyer. Sunk a light cruiser. Very nice. Sunk or shot down a German plane. Lost two planes in exchange for two German convoys and an Italian convoy. You know, I, I said we sunk quite a few ships last time. And we have, and it, it's been really good in doing that. However, uh... China, you might need to guard yourself a little better. Regardless. Uh, Germany still has quite quite a bit of soldiers, ships, planes, convoys, manpower, all that good stuff. Wow, they almost have 900 military factories. Holy crap. Uh, German, good, 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 good. So, every ship we destroy ultimately will help us out. Ooh, as well as every Italian ship we destroy as well. Uh, how are we doing here? How are we doing? Well... We're trying to attack. Ooh, better anti-tank guns, good. Let's see, you are going very carefully and striking when you can. Yeah, attacking 10 divisions at once probably isn't the best idea, and I don't mind screwing up infrastructure right now. That'll help us out. Uh, why are you guys not going? If I told you to do this, that wouldn't help anybody here. What if I told you to do that now? No. What if I told you to go crazy? Okay, so I, I see that our guys are a little retarded. That's okay. That's totally okay. Uh, let's see, just go up like the, along the entire coast or something. And yes, we got something else to research. Since we did our best, our next, anti tank. Rocket artillery, uh, am I using this stuff? Not really, not too much. Naval's M16 rockets? Huh. Better, more soft attack, that's nice. Uh, let's get some more resource extraction, because why not? Alright, let's keep it going. Sunk an Italian sub, two more Italian submarinos. Uh, how are the tanks doing up here? I told them to move around. I believe I did. Tankies, where are you? You are just kind of hanging out. Alright, you're not going to hang out anymore. You're going to actually do some damage here. you got to help us take out Canada in this episode. I said we'd do it last time, but... Obviously it didn't happen. So we're going to do it now. So, we sunk a German light cruiser. And we lost a plane in exchange for another German light cruiser. Now we have some... Oh, a submarine hole. Ah, here they are. I wonder why I set my submarines to 29 subs here. Pretty green. Pretty darn green. Uh, and they are trying to find any sort of convoy around here. Ooh, that instantly went yellow. Naval supremacy. Huh. Oh, some more stuff there. Uh, I am pretty much blocked off all of the Atlantic for the most part, because that's just, that's a little crazy to try to get to. There are three Italian destroyers, a German sub, an Italian destroyer, lost some allies, some more allies. Ooh, a German sub in exchange for a Japanese convoy, sounds good to me. And two more Axis ships, and then... Uh, the Japanese keep losing tons of tons of convoys. As well as the Fino Filipinos. Let's see. It looks like there's a lot of things here. So we 
we have any spare naval bombers because now we only have 500. So we'll put in another 200 here, see if we can rack up a little few more kills and have a good time. Over here, we sit anything? Oh, destroyer. I forgot about this area of the world. That being said, let's pause it real quick because right now it's a freaking mess. You guys get over here. Here, just come over here. It is, this is terribly messy. It's fine with me. We do want all of Papau, and then we will invade Australia and New Zealand. Yeah, a lot of this has to be refixed. Sam, wait, why are you, why are you in China? Oh, this is the group we put over here. Actually, I don't mind you help defend for now, but some of these guys, like you, need to go ahead and try to reinvade other places, such as, like there. Go ahead when you can. I don't really care about the other divisions I just placed elsewhere. Uh, we're going to have to redo all this. That's okay. Oh, German submarine sunk. Another German submarine sunk. The Germans, uh, oh, at least the Japanese are guarding some of their convoys. That's nice. Uh, 22 French convoys sunk. That's pretty good. I'm not going to lie. That's pretty darn good. Anything else here? Another German sub. Good. Oh, an American convoy. Two American convoys. Soviet. Canada, how are you doing? I hope my tanks are doing a great job. Because if they're not, I will be very disappointed. And actually, you know what? Go right on ahead. Slowly expanding into Canada. Oh yeah, and we need better anti-tank stuff. Yeah, Go right ahead, boys. Ooh. Two more French convoys sunk. It's good. I'm really interested in the ships that were sunk. Kiwi convoy. German convoy. Submarine. Oh, we lost an... Convoy of our, for ourselves. Convoy's lost. Sub. Actually, uh, let's see. We got 155 Coast Guard divisions. Uh, basically, Coast Guard divisions. I'm going to start putting them all around here. Even though this will hurt our convoys ultimately, I kind of don't mind doing it like this just because this way the Germans can't reinvade this area. Or the French or the Spanish. You never know who might just invade. Let's see. Who dares wins? Very nice. Nation Francais. Yeah, you might as well do all this as well, because we'll get down here eventually. And do all of Australia. Yeah, I'll pretty much do all this as well when we get down there. Because I'm pretty much... I pretty much already know that we will have to come down here to do all this. Also, uh... Yeah, Hong Kong in this area, just because the Germans did invade there. And Vladivostok. Yes, definitely. Oh, they took all of the Sakhalin... Sucklin Island. Yeah, that's an island. That's not a peninsula. That's an island. I was watching Drew Dernil and he was doing Peninsulas United or something like that. Alright. All right, let's speed it up just a little bit. Spanish sub. All I'm doing is just checking out for any like losses in the sea. I'm not even looking at anything else. Uh, you guys having a good time, huh? Oh, they have some light cruisers over here. That's not good for us. We did sink a French convoy though, so that's pretty good. 15 nukes. You know what would be a cool mechanic I just thought of? If you could, like, steal nukes. Now, that wouldn't make any sense, really, at all. But, you know, I have... Oh! I have, like, 15 nukes. Imagine if, like, the Germans or the Italians, like, sent, like, an espionage unit to steal, like, a fat man or a little boy or something. That'd be really cool. Let's see. So, we sunk the pride of the Italian fleet. They had five heavy cruisers, a light cruiser, and two destroyers. Yeah, they're pretty not great ships. From 150 naval bombers. They managed to shoot down four of my guys, but I would say I probably made out in that deal a little bit better. Alright. This is like Convoy Simulator. Uh, wait, do we have... Oh, we have also other outdated equipment such as ships I'm trying to make, such as Super Heavy Battleships. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, we can't make a lot of these ships just because we're out of chromium. Cuba. 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 Man, I've been so nice to you. You gotta deliver the goods. Convoys, whatever. German sub sunk, whatever. Uh, how's Mongolia doing? I think they're. I think we're doing okay here in Mongolia. They're pretty good infrastructure, I would say overall. Uh, can I improve infrastructure anywhere else? It looks like the Germans aren't doing so well now. Eisenhower, or no, you're Courtney Hodges. Courtney Hodges, you look kind of like Eisenhower. Does anyone have upgrades? No. How dare you? Oh yeah, I mean we haven't been fighting for that long. 
One more Bradley. No. No. All right, then. So be it. I mean, overall, this is not going ba badly at all for us, so. Uh, let's see. Oh, more lot. Oh, my gosh. Another convoy. It's only two convoys lost. Spanish sub, Spanish sub. Two German convoys, three German convoys, another sub. Another sub. Lost a convoy. The French did. They lost another French convoy. The Germans are trying to get into Minnesota. As Bad for us. Uh, we did... We Oh, we got Montreal. And where's... Do we have Ottawa? We do have Ottawa and Montreal. That's pretty good. Unitary Canada. They're 84% of the way towards capitulation. That's good. Very nice. We will need our Coast Guard divisions to pretty much guard all of Canada when we're done here. Yeah, they're, the Germans are trying to take out Alaska, but there's really nothing in Alaska. So yeah, We will need actually a few more Coast Guard divisions, though. Go figure. Oh, my goodness. Subs, planes. Ooh, eight German ships. That's pretty darn good. Another eight German ships. If you couldn't read that, I mean, I'm clicking pretty quickly here. I lost two convoys, sunk a German sub, sunk a German sub, and then we lost four allied convoys, sunk a German sub. I don't even care about these anymore. Ooh, Mark Clark. Mark Clark fell ill. Lots of convoys. That's how you're going to kill the Axis navies or Axis armies off and their manpower. Just by killing all their convoys. Oh, right. So we got two more divisions, or I guess one more division here. 20 width, you are coming to this guy. Yeah. Those noises were very necessary for that. Oh, that's actually pretty far away. Um, no, you come to home defense. Screw it. Nice. Uh, guys, something tells me... Oh, shh. Nope, 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 nope. Uh, I don't actually mind doing this first, because I kind of screwed up here. I just want you guys, yeah, to do that. I don't know why I grabbed everyone else. Let's see. Nice, two more spent. Oh, that's not really good, uh, Lost two allied Filipino convoys. Destroyer sunk. Lost a plane. Whatever. Whatever. Nice. Oh, yeah. The Americans have definitely landed down here. That's good. Yeah, that's good. And I will have to reorganize all this, of course. I will probably reorganize this one army who is fighting down here in Papal when we can kick. Oh, we actually lost a. Sh we sunk a ship there. Two more German destroyers. And another German light cruiser. When we have kicked out the Germans out of China. Now, over here, we're not going so great. Russell Hartle. Uh, I'm not really sure what you're up to. It's only a tank division, you know? And we can't pierce him, but you know? That's probably because we don't have enough anti tank on everything. That's probably why. Yeah, that's, that's probably why. Oh, we lost probably another convoy. Yeah, another convoy. So be it. Oh, actually, we've been losing a lot of convoys. Holy crap. We only have 143 Coast Guard divisions. Well, let's see. Who, what, how many, what, what puppets do I have that I could borrow? Borrow a few divisions from that may or may not come back to their homeland. Venezuela. Do you have any forces? Oh, you have four, just like right now in real life. Okay, very interesting. Uh, let's see, home defense, you come over here. Do I have any other American divisions? Yeah, I don't want my American divisions to die, so I'll go ahead and put them on coast. And oh my gosh, Mexico, what is this template? Artillery? Oh darn, I was hoping it was artillery only, but you know, whatever. Let's see. Oh my. Oh yeah, they are sinking quite a few things down here. Coasts of Japan. We might need to put a couple planes around here then. Let's see. We got some tactical bombers. We got a few heavy fighter twos. We're out of heavy fighter three, so we must be losing quite a few. Planes or ships. Planes around there. Naval bombers. Carry naval naval. Oh my gosh, we're down to 30, 30 naval bombers. That's really not good. So we'll get some close air support if we can. Uh, yeah, that close air support's not great, but hey, it'll, it'll help out. Right now, medium tanks, medium SPGs, shell dies. Very cool. Modern tanks, strategic bombers. Uh, naval bombers. We need to make more privateers, but we're not really making any. We don't have a surplus of modern tanks just yet. We are out of anti-tank, of course, still. Hmm. We need more rubber. But. Naval bombers are up here. Uh, I don't mind increasing it by three. 
but we do need a little bit more rubber, which we can get from Brazil, and we don't need any convoys for this, so that's absolutely what we're going to do. Absolutely, positively. What is this? Naval Mines Damage. I don't even use Naval Mines, but Naval Mines Avoidance could be very good. Of course, so that's not too bad. Uh, let's see, a couple divisions and trapped, trapped here. Good, take them out, end them, end them miserable existence. All right. Um. Oh, looks like the Germans are trying to attack us down here, but of course, a lonesome defending, two lonesome defending divisions will hold out graciously against the enemy. Oh my gosh. Oh, we lost seven convoys. That's not good. Patrols? Uh, engage at medium. You should be fine at medium. Oh, uh, Task Force 10 has too many destroyers. Task Force 10. Let's see. United States Task Force 10. Alright, so from this, I will assign new ships to be made in New Brunswick. No, 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 no. no. Somewhere on the west coast. California 10. Why? Because I'll add them to the Pacific Patrol Fleet because we still obviously need it. Seven more convoys sunk. Jesus Christ. See, we have only 141 of those got... Oh my gosh, we only have 141? What happened to the four Venezuelan divisions we just added in? Uh, you know what, that's what they... I almost have a million casualties. Holy crap. Oh, Mongol... Mongolia is about to expire. So as well as Canada. I don't know why I said expire, but, you know, capitulate. Germany has lost one and a half million. Not bad, not bad. Not bad at all. Land war in Asia. Well, we're doing pretty well in Asia so far. Not gonna lie, we're doing pretty well. I mean, we're holding off here-ish. But, India, trying to break into India is a little difficult right now. I don't think you, Maurice has any sort of skills yet, but that's okay. Go ahead and speed it up a little bit more. What's going on here? Oh, you're trying to kill my uh, submarinos, eh? Oh, I see what you're up to. Let's see... Sanders speaks out against government policy. Well, I don't think it would be a popular thing to speak out against the government right now. You know, just saying. Especially before war with the Axis, which includes two to three, two and a half. That's pretty good for us. That's pretty darn good. Wow, look at all this. What's going on here? German sub, six Mexican convoys. Uh, German sub, German sub, Americans, yeah, blah, 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 blah. Oh, nice. Four more German subs. Alright, then. Ace pilot promoted. Very nice. Yeah, we are trying to attack like crazy, but or something here. We're not doing very well. Go ahead and lower yourselves to that level. Oh, and you guys are not starving, but you are hurting for supplies. Alright, then. Alright, sunk another Italian convoy. Very nice. Uh, let's see. Tanks, please be. tell me you're doing something here. Oh, Joseph Stillwell falls ill. That's fine. Actually, since these guys look pretty weak, can they not get enough supplies through here or something? You guys, just break your way through here. Break your way through here. Finish off this part of Canada if you can. Uh, let's see. You're not fighting yet, so come up here. Since you're engaged over here, you will come up here. Oh, what is this? Expeditionary forces are called back from the United Mexican States? Why? Are you in a state of civil war or something, Mexico? What are you doing? Uh, Mexico, you might need more conscription. Daily communism support. That's not good. Oh, but we have daily democracy support, so that's okay. Oh, some Japanese convoys. Some more subs, some more subs. Yeah, we will beat the living crap out of all those German subs. Right, so you guys come here, take them out. And I will continue to unleash the tanks against our enemies. Who is this? Oh, these are the Colombian divisions that are trying to get up all the way up here. Oh, screw it. Go ahead, guys. Just go ahead. And Unitary Canada's capital is Winnipeg. All right, well, whatever. Oh, we've got two more Marines. So let's go and add you. Uh, home defense doesn't really need anybody. Uh, I guess I have to send you up there. Um, let's see. I probably don't need any more of you guys. Infantry divisions... I don't know if I need any more of those guys, so we're going to station them near in California here. 
Uh, let's see, Marines. I don't think I need any more Marines. I think we're pretty good at this point. Uh, Pacific Theater, even though you're really not even in the Pacific anymore. Well, you're on the Pacific-ish area. Alright, so has have the Germans been kicked out of China yet? No. Uh, whatever, whatever. God, this is going to take forever to do. I had quite a, quite a few divisions down here. Alright, how is Mongolia? Come on, guys. Just, just, just kill the Mongolians off. Oh, it looks like you. this part is missing some radar. It's fine. Witch hunt, whatever. Jeffrey Keys wounded. You look like you have greater odds of winning more battles here. So we'll do that. Uh, oh, wait. You're on extreme. Oh, my gosh. That might not be a good thing, especially with all this terrible infrastructure all over this place. Which we do have a little bit of capabilities of improving our infrastructure, so we might as well do that. Oh, and definitely over here. Mandalay definitely needs it. So many ships down here. Holy crap. We've been losing so many coasts and defense guys. They're, the German subs are easy to kill, but they do a lot of damage. Yeah, alright, whatever, whatever. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Uh, how are our planes? Our planes are we're still in the green, okay? But we definitely need more naval bombers. That's not good. Naval bombers, where are ya? There you are. Let's see. Italian convoys. Nice. Very nice. Just keep on killing these guys. You guys. Alright, so we are trying to attack this down here, but it's not really working out so well for us. Uh, we have enough radar, we definitely have enough radar. Uh, Mexico wanted it, its, oh my gosh, its expeditionary forces, which is going to be a problem. So, that's why I took all of these guys' as divisions, and you'll be instantly added here. There you go, 164. I knew I had extra backup divisions. That's why you want a puppet instead of anything else. You guys, make sure that these guys are returned home. Peacefully, and by peacefully, I mean into the graves. You guys actually come down here. Make sure they don't try to backdoor us. And... Uh, yeah. It's just a little laggy. It's still March 1947. And it's just all this lag that's... As results in us going a little slowly. Wait, are these guys defeated? Yeah, they are. Oh, wait, who's... Expeditionary Forces? Columbia? What the heck, Columbia? I... I am not your overlord. No. But Venezuela, I am. Peru? Actually, yeah, I'll get Perus then. I'm going to see if I can get as many divisions as humanly possible. Oh, you're not my god dang it, puppet. Uh, I don't want to use American lives for coasts and defenses. So... I put my infantry. Uh, you'll be kind of backups. The backup. And you know what? Just be like over here. Very cool. Yeah, keep it going because it's already pretty slow as is. So many ships sunk. And yes, China is taking forever to get rid of these guys. Oh, and they are expanding a little bit, which is which is de convoys. That'd be great. How's the front looking? I mean, the front's looking very good. I'm surprised Mongolia hasn't capitulated yet, but, you know, whatever. As we go down here. Very good. Coast of Defense. You guys are over here. Oh, look at Popal. Awesome. Frickin' awesome. Really frickin' awesome. Actually, you guys come over here. Uh, China isn't doing so well where we need them to be doing very well. Ah, uh, screw it. You know what? We're going to do this right now. Set on slow. Uh, you know what? Send three at a time. What we will do, we will invade from here to get that German... Wait, you don't, you don't need to do that. You can just walk over there. Alright. And I'll start from the bottom then. One, two, three. You'll come from here and you will invade... The German Reich, yeah. I doubt you'll need all three divisions, but regardless. 
it's always better to travel in packs. Then you guys will invade here. Uh, let's see, not bad. And up there and over here. That should be good enough. Yeah, cool. Pause it. And let's see, research. Really, not much we can really research better. Field hospitals, I guess. Uh, yeah, a lot of ships are sunk and lost, and yeah, blah, 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 blah. Let's see, come back to here. Jackrabbits. Oh, you guys are down here. Well, I don't mind Germany trying to expand down here a little bit. That way we can sink a lot more ships and convoys of theirs. So that's kind of like a bait tactic I'm going to use. You guys, you get over here. I take Bowen. One, two, three. Y'all will come from this island as well to take Vichy France territory. That'll be good. Because we are raiding down here a little bit. Three more divisions. Ooh. I don't want to be around Australia too much. Come from here. And can you take... I doubt we can take Wellington. So let's try to take Auckland. Let's try that. And then... Yeah, put him over here again. We're invading this. We definitely probably need to invade that. Not a valid island to invade. Okay, whatever. I don't know if we can invade that with two divisions, but we'll see what happens. Oh, wait. I need to left click. Alright. And then, yeah. Go to, go to this word that I'm still not going to say. Because I don't want this to be flagged. What the heck is going on? Uh, maybe that's too many on one spot. Come to the Jap Japanese island. And... Oh, I don't... I haven't selected that one yet. Alright, that's, that's enough divisions for now. Let's see who, who who actually survives all that. Oh, Japan is doing very well. They're invading the East Indies again. <laughs> Funny how that works, you know? I only have 90 convoys. Yeah, I'm going to need to make more uh, convoys, probably. Let's see. California probably has some space. That. Mongolia. I'm trying to build some radar up. Uh, what is this? I lost a convoy. Blah, blah, blah. Lost a little something, something. How's Virginia looking? We have 33 of these guys. You know what? We're going to add this. This group. Actually, before we do anything, let's see. That's enough. That's pretty good still. That's pretty good still. Uh, that's that's only screens. And that's not bad. Eh, let's add another one over here. And you will be patrolling as well. Set to that. Engage at medium risk. Because this will actually give us even better chance of killing more German subs, or maybe not German subs, but, you know, more subs in general. Uh, yeah, let's do 1946 stuff, advanced rocket engines, sounds good. Any upgrades needed? Anybody? Uh, we won't need more naval bombers, so. Especially when we try to invade Germany, or if we ever try to naval invasion. Oh, nice, we split up Canada. Uh, where are my tanks? This is my naval screen. Tanks. Infrastructure is crap. So with that in mind, you guys will be doing this front by yourselves, which you should be able to do. Uh, don't be too crazy. Just crazy enough. Take these guys out, as I will probably forward everyone else. Yeah, you guys take this area, except you two will come over here. And then you'll make a pit stop over there. Oh, let's see. Good, good, good. I want to capitulate... The Canadians before we're done here. Oh, it looks like we researched something else now. And Colombia took back all their divisions. God freaking dang it. Colombia, you're killing me here. Uh, do I have any other puppets besides Japan? Korea? Oh, Korea, yeah. Uh, sorry, Korea. Uh, if you if you guys die, um, make some more. I mean, I did, you know, liberate you from your oppressors who are now my babies. But regardless, who do I actually own? Venezuela and Peru. Oh, Haiti, do you have... Oh, no, Haiti is not a puppet. God dang it. I think that's all the puppets I actually have. Um, well then. I'll have to do that. Sunk two of those boys. Canada, please fall. Like, there's no point for you living anymore. And we've taken almost... Oh, we've taken a ton of casualties. It's just all this naval war... So, really unfortunate. But, you know... What else are you expecting if the United States and a few of our allies have to go to war against Germany, who's taking out Europe, Africa, with her allies? I mean, 
Oh, nice. We shunk, shunk. We shunk a battleship, and we shunk also a battle cruiser, and two heavy cruisers. Oh my goodness! Wait, FDR. It's 1947. He passed away. Has been in decline for some time. His strong presidential campaign convinced many that he had many years left. However, the possibility of FDR's death while still in office has remained, and today he passes away after suffering a stroke. Vice President Harry S. Truman has now taken the oath of office, requesting the support and prayers of the people. The old cabinet remains, and Truman has vowed to continue many of the policies of his predecessors. Oh my gosh, Truman. You're from Arkansas, because I was visiting Arkansas once, and they. Arkansas honestly doesn't have that much to. If, you know, fame. But they do claim... Oh, no. No, he's not from Arkansas. I was in Arkansas, but to get to Arkansas, he's actually from Missouri. Because I remember they have this little stupid boot thing here, which is kind of stupid. Missouri is a very weird state. Just a small part of it really claims to be in the south, but Missouri claims to have Truman. And besides dropping those two bombs to create some anime, he's not really known for very much more. Oh, yeah, I told you guys to go. I forgot about that. Whatever. You're not even ready to go. Anyways. Uh, we just need more time. That's really all we need. Just more time to help kill off Canada. Uh, we're looking very good down here in Mandalay. Uh, Burma. Is this, this, this is Burma. This is Burma. Yeah, that's right. Burma has Burma as a core. Well, I hope so. Uh, what's going on over here? Ooh, submarine was hit. Very nice. Are we actually trying to invade this country the Kiwi Empire yeah you won't get striked or hit or anything like that on YouTube if you say that right if you say Kiwi Empire because no one knows what a Kiwi Empire is right uh, let's see East Asia is looking quite a bit better now Ooh. okay we got some American territory stuck up here uh, we could make I wish we could make a really really good encirclements maybe we can let's see you hold off yeah, good. If we can encircle these divisions, that'd be great. A couple more boys here. Filipino divisions and a tank. Okay, let's see. Filipinos. I forgot the Philippines are my uh, loyal allies. Yeah, we're going to call them loyal allies. I need you guys to kill these guys off. And actually, since we have this. Yeah, there's a couple of divisions over here. A couple of ships. That's really not a big concern. In t oh, they still have Quebec, so we need to take out Quebec. Canada, you should fall pretty darn soon. Yeah, they're going to fall with one more percent taken from them. Which probably includes Winnipeg. So, And Winnipeg is not guarded by Canadians. No, your history is wrong. They're guarded by Italians. Because nothing says Canada like Italians. Alright. Destroyer, destroyer, my good god. We are so much losses. But honestly, I'm not even angry. I just know, or upset, I just know that it takes a ton to kill off the axes like this and honestly I could probably lose more and there goes Canada I could probably take a lot more losses than if I wasn't really planning this Japan is doing a great job I mean them nothing screams Japan more like owning the East Indies during the 1940s ah oh, love it all right so let's take a quick look at what we've accomplished what we've done Canada you know what it's been a long time coming but oh my gosh so, we can we sunk the pride of the French fleet now. Battle cruiser, obviously the carrier, and a destroyer. In exchange for a couple of ships, or planes I mean. And we sunk eight more German ships and lost a couple more planes as well. So, that's pretty darn good, I would say. Uh, yeah, with you guys, just, just kill them all. Like right now. Please just kill them all. It's like, go straight in there. Alright, so, like I said, at the end of this episode, we would take Canada. We've done that. Oh, our war support's actually really bad because our trying convoys have been getting absolutely murdered. But regardless, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. We have accomplished what I wanted to accomplish. And North America, within the end of the next episode, will be fully American, except for Mexico. So, Thank you very much for watching, guys. Leave a like if you liked the video. Subscribe if you're new. And I will see you tomorrow as we continue to push pretty darn well into the Jim and the Reich. Thank you very much for watching.